All right, everybody, afternoon trivia recap. So during the afternoon trivia announcement video, I mentioned that there was a particular genre that we've kind of had slid under the to-do list lately and just haven't done it in a long time. And it just came to my head the other day. We let off today's afternoon trivia today with this genre. It was all-time actor first names trivia. Got a late start today. It was 4.30, already getting dark. Uh, so it felt like evening trivia, but it was afternoon trivia. You know, we did that actor's names and Free Jack Balls, who was the hero of last week's afternoon trivia. He, uh, he was sitting on a two game win streak in afternoon trivia, led off with a, with a sweep, a clean sweep in that round. In the next round, I think it was, he got to pick 1973 song titles trivia. And Free Jack went to sweep again. Now granted, there's people in there. Okay, so we have we have people in the room. And so Free Jack goes back to back at 10 in a row. Uh, mysteriously ducked out at that point. We had a third round. This would be the final round. It lasted a long time. It was, uh, what was the 1977 song titles trivia? Now, only three rounds in this uh, in no this November 20th afternoon trivia rounds, but pretty eventful. We had the two sweeps, and then in the next round we had uh, Brett went up two to nothing, and then some. Then she, I think, yeah, she had to duck out, and then we had. A few other people come in there and start getting points, and it was uh, it started to finally pick up and build up uh, steam. Uh, we had a rare, we had a Z-Man sighting. Now he's had a lot of trivia history, as far as getting things like like he got a couple of quadruple steals in his uh, in his career, but he came in there and he was up to four. He got to four points. Uh, and then EMG was up to four points. And then uh, Eli was doing well too. I think he had a couple in that round too. Uh, Eli, I was kind of an under the radar trivia player, especially in afternoon trivia. Doing well the, on the 1977 song titles, talking about going to see Electric Light Orchestra with Jeff Lynn three times in his life. So. Kind of cool little nugget there. Andy comes in like he always does, and he was sitting on, I think, one point, gets back, gets three straight double steals. Uh, we had a triple steal on the board at that point. Z Man, Antoine, Andy Gibb, it was his name, and EMG, who couldn't quite. He had it a couple of times. He had the win a couple of times, but he couldn't close it out. Uh, had, had a couple of little typos in there, but he was very classy. In defeat as Andrew closes it out with a Kraftwerk song, I believe that was. Uh, Trans Europe something, I forget the name of that. Not a Kraftwerk uh, expert, but Andrew picks was a lot of Chinese food talk today, especially uh, I'm so talking about the house special Mayfoon. That was one of the choices for Mr. Wong's too, but Andrew ends up picking the uh, crispy chicken, um, crispy honey chicken or something. That could be something really good, but we'll do a video for that for the pickup and for the close up. So don't worry about that. All right, if you're playing trivia right now, just remember uh, tonight's featured presentation, uh, Molly's Pilgrim, 1985, a short film. It's available on YouTube, a couple of VHS uploads. I highly recommend it for, this was night four of Thanksgiving Fest. This is my third Thanksgiving Fest film viewing of Thanksgiving Fest, trying to go for about six, but it's a very nice 23 minute 
uh, short film. I teared up in this very, uh, very good movie, all about the true meaning of Thanksgiving with uh, Sophia Ileas Zova as uh, as Molly, and I list some other names here. All right, their relation, and I have some. I'll list some of the others there. All right, so I hope you're enjoying Thanksgiving Fest features. Someone mentioned planes, trains, and automobiles today. And don't forget, tonight, uh, we, NFL Week 11 comes to a conclusion with the game of the year so far. The Super Bowl 57 rematch and Super Bowl 58 preview. Philadelphia Eagles and Chiefs both trying to secure that number one seed in their respective conferences, 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time on ABC. Uh, all right, so we'll do a um, we'll do a pickup video for Wong's, and thanks everybody for contributing to Afternoon Trivia. It was a lot of fun. Three games only: Free Jack two, Andy three. I thought Free Jack was going to start a you know a streak. He had four. Afternoon trivia wins in a row. The current streak is Andy with one. So we'll see what happens for, for the next.